Hey guys, I went to Bath and Body Works and I did go the time that where they had the sale going on. If you would like to see what I purchased, what things I like from there, keep on watching this video. I think it's a mini haul because I just bought a couple of things, but knowing this store, it's like expensive, expensive. It's a pretty big haul. I don't think I've ever spent this much. I did have a coupon of $20 off, but you did have to spend $40, which I think it was worth it because I did buy a lot of things. At the end, I didn't end up paying as much. So let's just get started. Let's get right into it. I've never purchased a body spray from Bath & Body Works. Not that I remember. I don't think I have. Like I've gotten them as gifts. I've gotten lotions as gifts. But I've never purchased anything for my own, for me to use, for me to spray on myself, for me to apply on myself. So I bought this, um, this one's a beautiful day. My sister-in-law likes this one, so that's the reason I got this one, because I might be gifted. This one's a 24-hour moisture. She smelled good that when she applied it. She got this one as well, because we went in together. Now this one I'm going to be using tonight. This is the body wash. Yeah, body wash. Moisturizing body wash. This one says it has shea butter, coconut oil, and cocoa butter. I told uh, the lady that works there, I asked her... I just wanted a body wash, something that was hydrating, something that doesn't leave my skin dry. She recommended this one, so she said, come back if it doesn't work. This one was worth it, and she likes it, so that's the reason why I got it. She recommended it to me. I got a couple of antibacterial hand gels, and I'm trying to grab them here. These were, I think they were 92 cents, and they're originally priced at 175 but with that coupon, I got them on sale. At least I think so, right? I got a good deal, 80, 92 cents. And these last a long time actually if you don't use them like every day because I don't use them every day. I only use them when I go out. Three, six. I got six of them. Look at all these. Ocean Citrus, Jingham, Shell Braid, Island Papaya, Tiki Shore. Tiki Shore again? Where did I get two of those? I don't know. Watermelon Lemonade. I don't know why I got two of those. But anyways, I got the little baggie to go along with it. And it's so cute because it has a butterfly here. The one I used to have to carry my hand sanitizer, I liked it because it had the opening at the bottom and I would just squeeze it and I didn't have to take it off from my purse or from this little mini bag. But I wanted something different just because the little bag was cute. I could w use it with any bag and it's not going to look like it doesn't belong or it doesn't go with my bag. But I hope I don't forget my hand sanitizer. That's the bad thing. That's the reason why I got the other one, the Hula Girl. Because that one... I didn't have to take it out from my purse. I would just be like, who wants some hand is tan sun ties? And I would hand almost my big old bag around. I got two candles. So my sister-in-law and I went because it was a semi-annual sale. Semi-annual sale. Yeah, the semi-annual sale. So we went and we're like, let's just go see what, what they have, what kind of things that are on sale. She did end up buying a couple lotions and things that she liked. And I saw this candle. I was like, I just went in and I'm like, I'm not going to buy anything. I, I don't think I want anything for myself here. I ended up smelling this and I loved it. I fell in love, guys. And I loved it. I ended up smelling this and this smelled so good. So I'm like, I have to buy this. But I had a coupon at home. So I actually returned the next day. I thought I wasn't going to be able to find it anymore because this was the only one. So I'm so lucky that I did find it. I put it behind the other ones and... I'm like, just in case they don't have it, because I, I was going to come back the next day. And she told me that they, she couldn't hold it for me, because I guess it was one of the on-sale things. Just in case they didn't have it, I smelled another one, and I liked it too. This one is the Stress Relief Eucaly Eu Eucalyptus Spermint. It smells so good, guys. I don't think I've ever bought a candle for myself. I'm gonna be, um, it's going to be lit tonight. Tonight, I'm litting this up when I shower. And this does say it lasts 24 to, what does it say here? It says uh, 24 to 45 hours. So I need to make sure to turn it off because I don't want to, I don't want to waste it on just one day. It has some extractions here just in case you didn't know because I didn't know because it's going to be my first time litting one of these up. It says before lighting, always trim the wick one fourth of an inch. Dispose of wick trimming and matches to keep debris out of wax pool, avoid drafts, set candle on heat resistant surface. Which is why I bought this thing over here. I don't know if this is just to look cute or if it's heat resistant, but I did purchase this about a year ago. This was $10.50. I paid original price for it. Usually I, I like to look for things that are on sale, couponing, but I couldn't find any coupons for this. So I think it's pretty cute. Look at this. How cute is this? 
Is this a heat protected surface? Uh, use exclusively with bath and body works. Sleeve may get hot during use. Allow to pull before touching. Doesn't say anything else. I hope this is the heat protective surface. This is, I hope that this works. And I got this one. This one was free. Because I smelled it and I'm like, it doesn't smell as good as the other ones. This one was, it smells good. Like, I really do like it. Like, I like it when I'm smelling it. But the other ones are great. This one's leaves. This one's for fall. And let's see, crisp red apple, gold nectar, warm clove spice. That's the scent it has here. Do not burn candle for more than three to four hours at a time. Oh my. Well, I guess, I guess I'm supposed to remember. I mean, I'm going to have to put a timer. That way I know when to turn it off. Have you guys ever burned these all day? Forgot to turn it off. I'm new to these candles. I'm new to this whole deal with the bath and bodywork candles. So I hope I like it. I mean, it's going to be my first time. I hope it doesn't disappoint. That's all I can say. I'll keep you guys updated. I'll let you know if it worked, if it didn't, if it smelled good. I hope it does. Like I'm hoping that once I lit it, that it'll smell as good as it does inside the candle. I guess that's pretty much it guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this bath and body works haul. Take care guys. And I will see you you that you're watching this video. I'll see you later.